guys, what's up? Hello, welcome. If you don't know who I am, I'm Deja. This is my channel, Shade of the Universe. And today, as you can probably see by the title, in these clothes over here, I'm giving you my quarantine haul. And these are all regular, normal clothes. These are not, this is not a loungewear haul by any means. I don't even think I have anything loungewear. And I find that that trend now is so weird. Like. I don't know, me personally, I'm not about to spend money to just sit in the house. Like, I know we're all in the house, but like, I, we have pajamas. Like, what? I've literally been wearing shit like this. Like, why am I spending money on leggings and hoodies and all these things just to like sit on my couch and eat Doritos? Like, and then I'm gonna ruin the clothes. Like, I've just been lounging. Like, I understand lounge, yeah, that's the point of loungewear, but like, just wear like, shit you can just like be ugly in. I don't know. I guess I only get cute when my boyfriend comes over, like, or whatever. But that's about it. Like, I don't know. I guess if you want to get into the routine, uh, the habit of being in a routine again and putting on clothes, but I do not feel like putting on clothes. Like, it's been so good. And that's going to be so annoying once this quarantine is over. I do not feel like wearing bras again. <sighs> so anyway, this is like, I guess a spring summer haul. I guess, I don't know when this is going to be over, by the time, who knows, it could probably be fall and winter by the time this is over, by the time people are, you know, get their act together, people are just like not wearing masks and do whatever they want, so who knows, so let's get right into it. Alright, so first we're starting with Zara, I'm starting off with this beautiful Star Wars top. Do I know anything about the Star Wars trilogy? I do not. Do I, or have I ever watched Star Wars? I have not. But doesn't this look amazing on me? I paired it with these denim, with this denim skirt I got from H&M, and then these boots from Nasty Gal, and I love it. I put on pasties so you, you know, can't see anything, but like, ah, uh, I will wear it just like this. I am super obsessed and then maybe like go on like yes yes ah so cute oh my god where am i going i uh i've been imagining this outfit in my head but like i've never put it on until now and like what this is a look well, my actual look for this top was a pair of light high-waisted shorts and like the flip-flop heel sandal thing that's going on. But I accidentally sent it to my old dorm, my old college dorm, and that's in New York. So I can't get it until quarantine is over. And I don't want to put any of my friends' health at risk to go get a package. So it's just sitting there. It's safe, it's cool, it's whatever, but like, this is a great option. You can style this up or down. I need to figure out what I'm gonna do with the bra situation here. Maybe I will just get better looking pasties and just chill like this. Like, what? 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 Yes, let me just get some like, maybe pasties in my skin color and not this nude flesh. I don't know how it's coming up on camera, but yeah. This is the back. Love this. <laughs> the next item we have from Zara is this, ah, this beautiful lilac lavender pleated sleeve top. Oh my God, look at, you can tell why I got it, right? Just for that effect right there. It's so cute. I bought this for work and yes, I am thinking about going back to work. So I was like, let me get, let me get some clothes for work because like, you know, at some point, Hopefully we all go back to work. So I just paired it with these jeans I got from I think it's like TJ Maxx. I don't know what brand these are. And then my like blue tight heel mules I got from Express a while ago. And like once again, a pair with this. Oh my god, so cute. Like um, I have two jobs. One of my jobs is a receptionist at a nail salon. Uh, 
Oh, my job is a receptionist at a nail salon, and oh, my nails. I work at a nail salon, and my nails are trash. My eyebrows are trash. My hair is trash. Like, ah, oh, this is probably that's. I've been so reluctant to get on camera because of this reason. Like. Whatever. I think I look decent enough. And look at the clothes. Don't look at me. I'm going to blur my face out. I don't exist. Just look at this top. Get into this outfit. All right. Up next, I have a few things from Nasty Gal. This is one of the items. And this is how I styled it with my American Apparel Black Joggers. And these Reeboks that match it really, really well. I <laughs> Um, actually, I think I bought these Reeboks after I bought this sweater. It's, it's like, I don't know. I think it's supposed to, at this point, the way that it's asymmetrical here, it's just like asymmetrical here. That's fine. I like the little bit of peak of skin and then all this skin here. Ah, uh, it's so cute. I love pastels. Pastels for spring, groundbreaking of I'm sorry, my cat is doing a lot right now. Um, but yeah, I think it's a really cute, it's really chill. I'm gonna run errands in this. I'm just gonna keep grabbing this bag because it's right here, but it's like, come on, like it goes with everything. And since I keep grabbing this bag anyway, I got this purse, it was ten dollars from Boohoo. This is the only thing I bought from Boohoo. Between you and me, I'm Boohoo, their stuff is pretty cheap, and this is pretty cheap quality as well. But like it gets the job done. I am obsessed with this purse. Like I am literally gonna be wearing it with like everything. So like whatever. I just really needed a white purse, ten dollars. It's a go. And by the way, I bought like a good amount of this stuff, like the first, like as soon as quarantine started. And like, I don't know about you, but like when it when quarantine first hit and it was like, you know, like only essential businesses were gonna be open. It seemed like all the websites was like, oh my God, we're, we're about to go under, we need business. Like, get them sales. We need people to shop, give them deals, give them deals. And then like, after the first two weeks, they was like, oh, these hoes about the shop. What are we worrying about? Like, let's go back to regular schedule programming. Like, so like, I got, the stuff from Nasty Gal and stuff from Zara, great deals. Everything in the beginning, great deals. They're still doing deals now, but I feel like in the beginning, like the businesses was like, Whoa there, we need to uh we need to give these hoes some deals. We need to stay we need to stay alive. We need to keep this shit going. <laughs> but oh my god. I am obsessed with this. Obsessed. And when my hair actually gets right now, I'm actually like cute, cute, like what? Where am I going? I could wear this now, just going to the grocery store, but like the mask, the mask is just not, no, oh. All right, and I also got it in purple. Ah, lilac is my color. Like, I love lilac. That is my color of the year. Like, I have multiple lilac items, as you can probably see here, and that you're going to see, and Ah, uh, it's so cute. This is one way I would style it. I have my pink high-waisted pants from Zara, and then I just have on some white kids. And then, like I said, keep grabbing this white purse. Actually, I feel like that's a lot. Let me, yeah, maybe I'll tone it down with like a black. What do you think, white or black? I'm just gonna have the black on at the moment, but. Ah, uh, it's so cute. It's really, really comfy. Um, I don't think I mentioned everything. If they still sell these things, uh, everything will be listed down below. They probably won't have the things I have on from Nasty Gal. And it's very interesting because I find it weird that there is Nasty Gal hauls. And then you just like, Nasty Gal only keeps clothes for all of like three days. Like, it's not like Fashion Over Forever 21 where it's like they have a big stock. It's like, it seems like Nasty Gal's stock is very limited. So when people do hauls, like you always like go and check on the clothes and they're not there. 
I don't know. I find that weird. So like these probably won't be here, but if they are, I will link, link them down below. All right, and the last thing for my Nasty Gal items is this sweater. When I tell you, this is the sweater of my dreams. I love this crop cardigan, oh my God. And like, funny enough, before I bought this, I don't know about you, but I love, uh, what's it? Is it Hailey Bieber? I don't. I always get her and the other person confused, but whatever I, outfit I liked, I'll put it right here. I was like, I love this outfit, and I stole it to a T. Like, I paired it with um, this Western style belt I got from Forever 21 a while ago, these high waisted jeans from HM, and then these little mules from Semi Shoe. And oh, it's so cute. And then, oh, where was this? Ah! Ah, ah, so cute! Oh my god, I'm obsessed with this. I would probably wear my hair sleek like this as well. It's like it's just giving me like model off duty vibes. Like I'm just like really into it. Can you get into it? Are you into it? Are you into it? Are you into it? I'm like, let me step back so you can't see my toes because my toes aren't done. Because we already know my, why my toes aren't done. So like, yeah, let's like. You know, spool her off the toes. Next up, I have a couple of things from Misguided. This is the first item. It's this Playboy gray hoodie, crop hoodie, and it's so comfy and it like stretches in the back. This is just one of the ways I would style it, just like really chill. Like, the purse out again. These purses are just so handy. These purses are just so versatile. I know everything. Oh my god, yeah, oh my god, this is so cute. Like, yeah, just like jeans, uh, same jeans I just had on from H&M, and then I style with my dad sneakers from Zara, and yeah, what I wanted to do, well, this is a set. I took too long, and the bottom sold out, so if you are selling the sweatpants, link your Depop, your Poshmark, whatever, I am looking for these sweatpants to do the set. But if anything, I'm just gonna buy some biker shorts, some uh, high-waisted biker shorts, similar to this gray color, and I think that'll be cute as well. So, yeah. I really like this. I love. I said I didn't have any loungewear, but this is definitely loungewear. I would not not wear this in the house. And that's the thing, they be having like all the cute little things and it's like, why am I wearing that in the house? Like, I wanna wear that outside. And then the only thing we could do is like go to the grocery store. I'm not wearing this in the grocery store. I don't miss wearing clothes that much. But if you do, I completely understand. I don't. I need to like actually be seen seen and go somewhere and like, you know, not wearing a mask with my clothes, so. All right, the next item is this chunky, oversized little cardigan. I've been looking for a good cardigan forever, and this is perfect. I love it. And look, I have another bag now. <laughs> um, so I styled it with this like plain t-shirt I got from Anna the Stories, uh, the jeans I got from TJ Maxx, and like these like Gucci dupe loafers that I got from Payless. Shout out to Payless. Rest in peace, Payless. Like, you were to go. You were to go if you did what you needed to do. I got these for like $12. Shout out. But yeah, and then this purse is also from Zara. Um, it's super comfy. I would just like, you know, this, I definitely probably will not be able to wear this once this is over. Like, it's hot. Like, this is hot. This is warm. Like, this could probably replace a coat by the time, like, fall starts. Like, early fall like when it's like 60 50 like this will be fine but it's so cute and comfy uh, just like you know chill girl vibes you know i couldn't even wear this around the house like this is really hot like i this is my first time actually like wearing it for a while <laughs> And the last 
last piece we have are, well, is, the last piece we have is this, what color is this? Sea foam? I think they said mint on the website. This mint, I'm just gonna say mint, blazer. I didn't know I needed this blazer until I seen it. Like, ah, ah. The only thing is it doesn't have pockets. Like what? I don't even think I use my po my pocket, my blazer pockets. But like, I like for them to be here. This also doesn't have a button. So I think I'm just gonna sew a button. I don't close my blazers, but I like the appeal of a button, you know? Like they miss out on the pockets and the button. But other than that, the color is beautiful. I paired it with same and other story shirt, uh, jeans from Target, and then these shoes. I got from PSW and they have like a little sea foam patch in the back so they like match perfectly and then like yes well I guess this I keep grabbing this this is also from misguided I got this with the same stuff as well and yeah oh my god I would definitely wear this to work this is like a chill like Wednesday Thursday vibe like you know it's not Friday you're not getting that many customers it's like you know you still want to be cute you still want to be relax like this is it. This is it for me. Super spring. Super obsessed. Ah, oh, it's so light. Oh my god. It's a great addition to my blazer collection. Yes, I do have a collection and I probably will do a blazer collection styling video as soon as I get two blazers that are just like in space somewhere because of coronavirus. So, I don't know, whenever I get those blazers, I will do a styling blazer. I love blazers, and I don't just wear them for work, like I wear them for me. I wear them for me, guys. I do it for myself. My boyfriend is always like, whenever I buy blazers, they're like, oh, you're wearing it to work? I do it for myself, okay? I want to look nice. Jeez. Next up is this cutout jumpsuit from Forever 21. I bought a couple of things for Forever 21, and this is the only thing I kept. I sent the rest back. Forever 21 is a big hit or miss for me, but it's so comfortable like it's like this nice soft silky material this isn't like you know sucking you in like i can move my thighs my thighs can breathe and it's so great i love this and like i would style it with this blazer because it's nice and big and oversized and i love the appeal of like you know Biker shorts and a top with an oversized blazer. I have like a bunch of um, things in my Pinterest board with that. And like, look, oh, like it's just so cute. Hold on, hold on. Also got these from Forever 21. And it's like, what? What? Yes. I also paired it with my Zara dad shoes. Like this is a big dad shoe moment, right? Like, sorry, I'm trying to, <laughs> I'm trying to scrunch these up to like give the like the aesthetic the look. Oh, and then this purse. I'm like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> and then this purse up here is also from Forever 21. And I can definitely, I can definitely do that. This is a look. This is a look. Let me not, let me not cover the cutout. Let me, let me give you all of the cutout. <laughs> oh my God, it's so cute. This bag is like $20. It is made so well. Like, it's so pretty. Like, yeah, it's $23. And then, like, they had a deal. Oh my God. Like, the structure. Forever 21 purses? Don't be sleeping on Forever 21 purses. They are so well made. Like, this looks so luxe to me. Like, I'm obsessed with this. This is great. This is a great $17. I love this look. I love this outfit. Like what? Oh my god. Come on. Oh. Next we have Missy Empire. Um, Missy Empire is kind of like on the same level as like Boo. I wouldn't besides these two items, I'm not really into Missy Empire, but like look at this balloon sleeve magnificent turtleneck. Definitely more than likely can't wear this. When quarantine is over. When I bought this, it was just like beginning to be spring. No, actually, no. 
Yeah, when quarantine first started, it was just like beginning to be spring. It's kind of like turning over into summer now, and this is pretty warm. But like, I styled it with my kids, and I got this skirt at Nordstrom. It's like beautiful donation. Like, I think it's so cute. And then I was paired with my Fuku bag, of course. Ah, it's so cute. I would probably wear a different pair of white tennis shoes, like plain white tennis shoes. I forgot what shoes I wanted to wear with this. It's been so long since I was like, I was so ready to wear this outfit to work. And then I couldn't. And now I'm just like, what was I gonna wear with this again? But get into it. It's so comfy. It's awesome. The funny thing about Missy Empire is like they'll do uh oh you can get three percent off or five percent off and it's like what like that's like 10 cent just i'd rather you not play with me like that oh it's so cute i have to get guys there's a lilac one i have to get it obviously like oh it's so cute this with like white jeans Black jeans. Ah, maybe get some white jeans. Some like white flare jeans. I would love that. Right, so the last thing that I got from Missy Empire, lilac, of course, is another balloon sleeve. They are great with the sleeves, guys. Like, it's so cute. And then it like has like this detail at the bottom so it's supposed to look like you know like you like sucked in and I just paired it with my H&M jeans and my semi shoes again sweaters with sandals sign me up big spring yes yes white bag actually let's I don't know let's do the black the black shoes oh that's cute that's cute that's cute I like that this one's so much shorter though and yeah, let's get into the detail of this. It's so pretty. Ah! Oh my god, with my hair actually done, guys? Like, this is a look. This is a look. I'm obsessed. Ah, with the sandals. Oh, bitch. Oh, definitely a New York look. Definitely going out. Let's get a mimosa or two like look like, yes. All right, uh, the next brand we have is The Crypt. This is my first time shopping with them. Um, my friend actually put me on. I do really like this blazer. I only have one neon blazer and it's pink. So I was like, oh, I love crop blazers. Let me get, you know, this green one, but like, I can't move. If I go for a hug, if I try to tie my shoe, like I'm gonna hold Hogan the shit out of the back of the blazer. It's a large, this was the biggest size. It feels like good quality. The shipment was fast, but I think I'm gonna put this on my Depop. So yeah, if you're interested in buying this, this is more for like a medium or a small. And then I just got this plain turtleneck crop top from there as well. I didn't have one of these. I thought it was gonna be longer, um, cause I wanted to wear it to work and like, you know, just like slightly tuck it in like some jeans, but it's not. So I'm kind of debating if I want to sell this as well, but I mean, it's fine for what it is. Oh, I really wish I could have kept this guy. It's like, oh, I can't even put the purse over my shoulder. Like, I'm scared I'm gonna rip it. I need to sell this to get my money back. And it was on sale, so sad. But I would definitely shop with them again. They have really, really cute clothes. All right, so the next brand we have is Fashion Nova. I don't usually shop Fashion Nova. I usually just like, you know, if I'm in need of shorts or like jeans, because we all know they are made for women who get they bodies done so girls on the thicker side are already you know going to look good in it so i'm just like you know everywhere else i just i just know what size i am so i got these shorts from there oh uh, um they're size 13 usually their shorts don't fit like this 
Like, I can fit them. But, like, if I'm bloated or anything, like, I can't. So, like, these are, like, really sketchy. But I love them. I love the rips. Um, they're low-key. They, when I sit down, they low-key give me, like, what's the ham hot, like, the meat that's in that, like, wrapped in that thing. That's low-key what they're giving me. Not standing up, but if I'm sitting down. So, like, if I'm... <laughs> on the train or anything, I'm definitely getting over these. I'm like, you can't look at my legs. And then I also got this uh, off the shoulder top. Oh my god. I don't know how it's coming across on camera, but like, it's just like pasties. <laughs> but yeah. Ah! I also got this, and oh my god, it's so soft and comfy. They have a baby blue one, and I want to get that, and then I'm done with them. But. Yeah, I'm really, really into this. I am excited to style these shorts. And then, like, I can wear this through all seasons, actually. This is, like, a great all seasons. Maybe not summer, because it gets really hot here. Cold summer nights. And if I travel, like, go to, like, California or something. But other than that, like, no. But, yeah. Really, really obsessed with this. And I just love their shorts and jeans. Like, they just snatch you in. Like, ah! What? What waist? It's like, I need to lose some weight for the, like, you know, I don't these shorts. Alright, so the last thing I have from Fashion Nova are these really, really comfortable, ripped, uh, faded, black, gray jeans. I love these. They fit great. I'm a size 13. And, like, uh, everything about, for the most part, Fashion Nova jeans, they just fit so nice and I don't really see me wearing these for like spring summer but these are definitely a fall or like a spring summer like nighttime look especially with like what I paired it with um this uh the line by K top that I made if you haven't seen that video I'll link it um it's super easy to make and the zipper is you know super big and trend right now and then I styled it with these DSW heels that I won't show a super close up with because my toes are not done and let me just put on yes yes ah I would definitely this is definitely a, a go out look like you can zip this up you can zip this more down just have a little peak probably a little bit more that there we go Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> ah, I love these jeans. All right, next up is kind of like a, it's kind of like a mixture of things. So you might have seen this top. This is a princess, well the sleeves at this point are from Princess Polly. Um, this top is really popular on Pinterest, on Instagram, but if you didn't know, these are not made for girls with big breasts. Like, I am a 36D, and like, the original top, like, came here, it was all mushing me up, and it was gross, and like, I couldn't wear it. So I was like, you know what, I don't want to take it back, it's too good. So I just decided to cut off the top and buy a bathing suit top from Pretty Little Thing and just sew the sleeves on. So it's still the original top, it's still like, you know, the sleeves and it's just with a bathing suit top and I love it. It's so good, it's so cute. It actually fits my breasts now, like, it's great. Like, I just styled this with these like, high-waisted culotte pants. I thrifted a while ago. My little express lucite heels and then my Jacques Mousse inspired bag that I have made. If you haven't seen this video, I will link it below. And I just think it's super, super good. I would definitely wear this to Mexico. I would probably change my shoes up, but like I'm supposed to be going to Mexico for my birthday. With the way quarantine is looking, I don't know if I can go, but I, whenever I do get a chance, hell, like, if this is over in September, I am wearing this to Mexico in September, and what? It's a look! I love it! It's just, like, so cute, it's like, oh yeah, let's go out, let's go shop, like, ah! It's so good, and it, like, ties in the back, I just was lazy and didn't tie it in the back, but 
Uh, I love that I kept it. And yeah, this is how I would style it. I actually have the perfect white heels. They're not here yet because they're from Xi'an and they're coming from China and they was like, oh, it's gonna take a while to come to you. So like, I would still wear white heels, not these, but ah, I love this. It's so good, so good. All right, next up are these amazing white wide leg pants. I got these from Target. I got these from Target and I've been looking for a pair of pants just like this forever and like I was not expecting to almost fell. <laughs> I was not expecting to find these at Target and like they are $30 and they are so good. They're like linen and billowy and soft and just like Perfect, perfect. Like, ah, they fit great. Um, I got a little size I get. I got a large, they were a little big. I could have sized down in a medium, but like I just sewn in the back. It has like an elastic back just so it could be more fitted here and like it's great. I styled it with this little blue ruffle top. I got this at Forever 21 like two years ago. I still have not worn it because like I wanted to wear it with like pants like these and now that I finally found them like ah oh, it's a match made in heaven like I love this and then I'm just wearing my semi little mule heels like ah oh, this is a look. I would probably also style it with my hair like this for a purse I'm not sure yet I have to go through like all my purses but like I just wanted to give you like the outfit that like I had in my mind so Yes, these are so good. They're so comfortable. And they also have a short version. Um, I think I'm gonna buy the shorts as well. All right, so the next thing I have is this amazing, once again, lilac sweatshirt, Adidas sweatshirt. I got this from Shop Akira. This is like the one and only thing I bought. I don't know, Shop Akira kind of gives me like, kind of like, on the cheapest side if it's not let me know in the comments down below i'm just very skeptical about that website about their like quality they do have some cute pieces i don't know and their price points are weird i don't know but i seen this and i had to get it like what really really sold me besides the color are these what like i never seen a sweater with this like i love this like i live in dc and my boyfriend is a Howard graduate, so we go to uh, Howard Homecoming like every year. And like this, I am definitely wearing this to Howard Homecoming. Like it's giving me like Beyonce, like Homecoming vibes, like her whole little like Coachella thing. And like, ah, I love this. It's like giving me school spirit, like, like pom pom. Like, is it not? Like, I love everything about this. This part is like a knitted like material. Um, and then this is more of an actual sweatshirt. I got this in a medium. I think I want to take it in a little bit so it can be fitted, but I also like that it's just like big. So, I don't know. I styled it with my uh, TJ Maxx little jeans with the hem, and then I have on these cowboy boots that I got from Target. Ah, don't sleep on Target. Like, they have great things. And this is just everything. I'm obsessed with it. Um, would I wear like a little bag? Let's see. Oh, I could. I could. Yeah, I could do this. Oh, how cute. I could definitely do that. Ah, I love this. This was such a great buy. It was like $60. Um, ah, I want to like live in this sweatshirt. Like, I love this so much. Like, All right, so the next few items that I have on my list are like gonna be like thrifted items. I got them from like Depop and Poshmark. Um, this top I got from Poshmark and the lady was selling it for $4. Like, I love it. It's in great condition, nothing's wrong with it, no stains or anything. It's just a polka dot top and like what sold me is this little like runching like knot thing right here. I am wearing this to work. Like this is such a like chill work top, you know, like appropriate, like cute. 
and like I just styled it with these like Levi jeans and my semi mules and like I can't wait to wear this to work. Like it's so cute. Like oh my god, it's so smooth and like ah I love polka dots and it's just everything. It means everything. I probably wear it with like the black bag instead. Yeah, the black bag's nice. I could do the white as well. I really, really love this top. It's so simple. And it's like, yeah, it's like perfect for work. Hey, the next thing I bought are these beautiful face print pants. I also bought these with wearing these to work in mind. Um, I got, I did get these off Poshmark. The girl was selling them for hella cheap. I don't think they fit her, but these are from Princess Polly, and last time I checked, they were selling these, so I'm definitely going to link these down below for you guys. These are so beautiful. They, like, fit perfectly. I keep about to fall. They, like, fit perfectly. They're nice and flowy. Like, they're not too tight anywhere. Like, these are great. They have pockets. They are awesome. High-waisted. I just styled it with a regular t-shirt I got from and other stories. And my blazer is not trying to go up. This blazer uh, is from Forever 21. And then my semi heels. Ah, uh, it's just so good. Like, so good. <sighs> these are perfect. Definitely wearing these to work. Like you can dress these up, dress these down. I'm gonna wear them with sneakers, heels, and wear them with a t-shirt, crop top, like so many different things. It's endless. Like I have, I don't have any pants like this. The only style I have are like pinstripe. And this is like a better take on like pinstripe pants. Like they're so cool. They're like a perfect statement piece. And they're black and white, so they literally go with everything. Right, the next thing I got, I got these on, I got these from Poshmark as well. These amazing, like, crop capri flare jeans. I love them. They have big pockets. They make my butt look good. They have pockets in the front, and then they have a pocket here. I am obsessed. They fit so well, and I just styled it with this crop t-shirt I got from Forever 21 my semi heels and this Louis Vuitton bag um I made this bag and I'm definitely the next video after this should be how I made this bag but like it's so chill like I love these jeans I'm gonna wear it exactly like this like just a chill vibe a chill day you can wear it with sneakers I love these I've been looking for a pair of jeans like these forever um, the girl was selling them for $13, like, ah, so, like, if you, like, need your thrift fix and, like, just need to, like, thrift Poshmark, Depop, definitely shop on there. The only thing is, if it doesn't fit, you're kind of stuck with it because you can't take it back or send it back and get your money back unless there's, like, a stain or a hole that they didn't tell you about. But, like, you know, that's just, like, the chance you have to take um but i'm glad i took the chance on these and i love these and i also got this belt from a girl selling on depop this was like ten dollars it's a fake gucci belt i do not need a real gucci belt in the slightest there's no reason for me to spend money on gucci let alone a belt for multiple reasons this does it for me. I had a Gucci belt, a fake Gucci belt in high school, and I had it all the way up until like college, and I accidentally broke it, and people thought it was real. I don't care if people think it's real. I don't care if people think it's fake. I just like the aesthetic of it, you know? And it's different than the little circle ones. So yeah, like this is everything. Is it a faux pas to wear Louis and Gucci, is that a lot? Do I look, am I a YouTuber now for wearing all these designers? <laughs> all these fake designers? <laughs> ah, I love it. Ah. So the next pair of pants that I got are these 
amazing light pink pinstripe flare pants. I love flare pants. I feel like they really help my shape. Like I feel like I have the, a, a perfect shape for flare pants, if that makes sense. But like these are perfect. They fit to a T, which isn't the safest thing. And then they're also, there's no stretch. So like I can sit, but like if I like eat, like really eat something, it's gonna be like squeezing the hell out of me. So like, you know, um, but my weight fluctuates so much that like, these could probably fit a lot better in like a little bit of time, but whatever. I just kept on the same tank top from Forever 21 and my Express Blue Sight heels and then the Boo Boo bag. This is a very chill way that I would style this. It's really, really cute. I love these. I also bought these with the mindset of wearing these to work. Um, I would definitely wear this and the shoes together for work. For the top, I still have to go through all my clothes. Um, I just got these like a few days ago, so I haven't really like styled it. Um, so yeah, I really, really like these. They're really, really nice. Um, the brand for these are Topshop. These are my first Topshop jeans. So yeah, um, I guess I'm gonna need to size up in these if I ever like actually buy jeans off the Topshop website. But for what they are, these are like perfect for spring. And uh, I don't have any colored denim in my like wardrobe. So like these are really gonna like pop and like bring some like fun to my wardrobe and I'm excited to like wear these. All right, last but not least, I got this beautiful, of course we gotta end on, <laughs> On the note of me wearing the main color of this haul, lilac, lavender. I got this beautiful lavender blazer from this girl off Depop. It is Calvin Klein. Ah, uh, it's so lightweight. It has shoulder pads. I usually take them out, but I actually don't mind them this time. Um, it came with like these disgusting silver buttons, and I took them off and just like sewn on black buttons instead, and I really like the pop of black along with the, you know, softness of this. So this is way cuter. Silver buttons were disgusting. Oh my god. Oh, oh I hate it. <laughs> um, I just kept on the same Forever 21 tank top. I have my Levi jeans, my Express mules, and my Boohoo white purse. And yeah, this is just one way I would style it. When my other blazers come in and I do my blazer collection, uh, I'll style it the way that I kind of intended it, like when I thought about this blazer. But yeah, it's perfect for spring. I also bought this in mind for work. I'm very responsible when buying clothes. I'm like, you know, I would definitely wear this outside of work, but I was like, you know, like, let me also get things for work. Not everything is play, you know, because I do have a job, I do work. So yeah, I love this. I love this. I love this so much. All right guys, so that is the end of my spring quarantine haul. Um, I have bought a lot more things, like I did buy a good amount of purses and shoes, but I'm thinking about doing a separate video for like a shoe and accessories haul. So if you're interested in that, let me know down below. Um, honestly, I'm not really gonna do a lot of hauls on my channel unless like I start getting companies sending me clothes because I'm very much like, I don't know, I, I feel like I'm very smart with my purchases. I don't just buy clothes, like I have a wardrobe. Like I honestly don't buy things unless I know that they're gonna go with at least like three to four pairs of shoes that I own and like I can make like five outfits off my head. Like I don't buy clothes and then I'm just like, okay, now I gotta buy something else on top of it. And it's like, what is gonna go with this? I very rarely do that. I try to have clothes that with the intent, mindful purpose of like, okay, I'm gonna wear these for years. A lot of my clothes that I already have, I've had for years. I try to get classic pieces. So like hauls aren't really a thing. I feel like people whose channels are basically, are like hauls are just very wasteful because they're not wearing all those clothes. And then the big thing is like cleaning out the closet. And it's like, you didn't wear any of those clothes. So like, you know, no judging, but like, that's just not me. So yeah. The hauls are gonna be far and few in between, but other than that, I do make 
DIYs all the time. All the DIYs that I make, I intend to wear and keep. So if you're interested in, you know, seeing more DIYs, more clothing videos and things of the sort, um, subscribe, give me a like, everything else that I'm supposed to say and you're supposed to do apparently. <laughs> and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.